Alright, here I'm going to consider this linear transformation where the, the quadratic here goes to this. I'm going to describe the image. That is, uh, the image of t, we can say pretty clearly, um, there's a plus b equals c, a plus b plus c, uh, such that a, b, and c belong to the real numbers. Since a, b, and c have to be coefficients of uh, a, a quadratic, but the coefficients are all log b equal numbers, so we have this. But I can actually simplify this a bit, because if you notice, this is the same as this. So I could simplify this just down to say a, a, such that a belongs to the real numbers. So, this is one perfectly good answer. So describe the image of, of t. This is what it boils down to. It's all, it's all possible pairs such that the two components are equal. Um, and you can see this pretty easily. Uh, definitely anything, any output, the two components will be equal. Also, you can get any pair like this by just having uh, a x squared plus 0 x plus 0 is going to give you a comma a for any a. If you want to think about this graphically, what is the set of AA? Well, we're in R2, so if you have an A there, the output's an A there, and so this is just going to be the diagonal line to the origin. So that's what the image is. So when you map this, this polynomial, it's going to land somewhere along this line. Uh, it depends on what the coefficients are. Thanks.